B L C K A M K Jenny and Rose power abuse. They should carry their own umbrellas versus it's for their safety. Amidst the unexpected meeting of B-L-A-C-P-I-N-K's Rosé and Jenny, which has captured netizens' attention, an untimely controversy over power abuse has arisen. On May 6, Rosé shared updates through her personal channel about her recent encounter with Jenny in New York, sparking discussions. It was reported that the two met while visiting New York for overseas schedules. In the photos that were made public, the two were seen arm in arm, smiling brightly or engaged in conversation, showcasing a friendly atmosphere. Additionally, there were snapshots of them enjoying a meal together at a restaurant. The issue arose when in a situation where the two were walking together, a man who appeared to be their security guard was seen carrying an umbrella behind them, which became a hot topic among netizens. Regarding this, Netizens expressed negative opinions such as they should carry their own umbrellas. It seems excessive for personal activities. They seem really comfortable. However, there were also many fans who countered these criticisms, stating, it's part of the security guard's job to hold umbrellas for them. It's for their safety. It seems necessary given the nature of their profession. Currently, BLACKPANK successfully renewed their group contract with YG Entertainment at the end of last year, but individual contracts fell through. Except for Rose, Jenny, Jisoo, and Lisa have each established their own separate labels and are actively pursuing individual activities. K netizens disappointed by BLACKPANK's Jenny and Stray Kids at 2024 Met Gala? The 2024 Met Gala looks of BLHCKINK's Jenny and boy group Stray Kids leave much to desire, said K Netizens. On May 6, BLHCKINK's Jenny and JYP boy group Stray Kids appeared at the 2024 Met Gala. Here, Jenny showed up in a blue skirt top ensemble and belt with pearl details, representing the sea and aligning with this year's theme, the Garden of Time an exhibition divided to three areas, land, sea, and sky. Meanwhile, Stray Kids originally appeared in black cloaks custom made by Tommy Hilfiger's, only to later take off the cloaks and unveil more colorful outfits underneath. Unfortunately, the appearance of both K-pop representatives this year were deemed as boring and disappointing by Korean netizens, who claimed that Stray Kids did not fit the theme at all while Jenny's outfit looked uncomfortable. Below are some comments from netizens. Asterisk, the clothes are just mediocre. Rather than feeling like a Met Gala look, it's just, fuck, ha. Asterisk, there really isn't much difference in men's clothing. All of them just wear suits. Asterisk, I like the outfits, but they look even less interesting than stage costumes. Asterisk, Jenny's skirt is so short. She looks so uncomfortable walking, asterisk, the outfit is a little ambiguous, asterisk, Jenny's outfit just looks uncomfortable. The case Jenny looks sexy in blue dress at Met Gala 2024. It doesn't match the dress code. Appearing at the fashion event Met Gala this year, BLHCKANK member Jenny stood out in a blue dress by the fashion brand Alaya. Following her controversial Met Gala debut last year, Jenny continued to join Met Gala 2024, which was held under the theme Sleeping Beauties, reawakening fashion with the dress code The Garden of Time. While almost all of the guests chose outfits with flower patterns according to the dress code, Jenny wore a blue customized outfit by the Alaya. A lot of people were surprised by the fact that she did not wear channel clothes this time. Park Minhee who has been working as BLHCKINK's stylist for years, was the person who created this look for Jenny. As her simple mini dress at last year's event received criticism, Jenny decided to wear something more impactful and revealed her superior body figure. A belt chain was added to the set to highlight Jenny's superior body figure. Moreover, blue not only suits Jenny's skin tone, but it is also her favorite color. Although Jenny looked quite small in photos taken by the media, including Getty Images, 
Her expressions were still captivating. It is undeniable that Jenny looked hotter this year, but many people think her outfit did not match 2024 Met Gala's dress code, which was the Garden of Time. In response to Jenny's appearance at the Met Gala, netizens poured compliments on her visuals such as, she's such a goddess. She's so hot. I was very surprised. She's so freaking beautiful. The outfit neither matches the dress code nor makes her look taller. The stylist once again shows a boring outfit. It doesn't have any The Garden of Time vibe. I can't see anything related to Garden of Time from this outfit. Maybe she thought she's a flower herself, etc. The LHCKPIAK's Jesu receives food truck from Jung Hai in Beautiful Snowdrop Friendship. Jisoo from BLACKNK expressed gratitude for the food truck she received from her Snowdrop co-star, actor Jung Hae In. On May 6, Jisoo published a photo on her Instagram, along with the caption, Yummy Crawfuls. Protect Yongju. The aforementioned photo reveals a food truck sent by Jung Hae In to support Jisoo on the filming set. Previously, Jisoo and Jung Hae enacted together in the JTBC drama Snowdrop, forming a strong bond. They continue to maintain their close friendship even after filming, radiating warmth. Meanwhile, Jisoo is currently busy filming the Kupang play original drama Influenza, which depicts the story of soldier Jae Yoon and his girlfriend Yong Ju fighting against zombie hordes against the backdrop of Seoul's high-rise building air defense unit. Zeko X Jenny's SPOT, Sweets Domestic and International Charts. Artist-producer Zeko has swept the top spots on major weekly charts both domestically and internationally. Zeko's digital single SPOT, Feet, G-E-N-N-I-E, topped the weekly charts of Melon, Genie and Buds for the latest week. April 29th till May 5th. Particularly on Bugs, the song has conquered the weekly chart by consistently securing the top spot on the daily chart since its release. As of 2 p.m. on May 6th, SPOT continues to hold the top spot on the Melon Top 100 chart and real-time charts of Genie, Bugs, and Flow, indicating that the success of this song is likely to continue. The popularity of SPOT that ignited in Korea is spreading overseas. According to the latest YouTube chart released on May 5th, aggregated from April 26 to May 2nd, SPOT claims the top spot on the global weekly popular music video chart.